Hey guys, welcome to another Trash World Live 1.8 video, and today we're gonna keep on uh, working with the hybrids. And in this video, we're gonna do Diplovinator. <laughs> Hopefully, that's how you pronounce it. So, this is the hybrid of Diplocalcian 2 and uh, Concavenator. Finally, Conk got a hybrid. Took them long enough. Uh, Diplogen 2. Uh, I don't, I don't see people calling for a Diplogen 2 hybrid, but hey, we got one. And um, it really does narrow down the uh, the dinos that don't have hybrids right now. Like, just looking at the stuff that don't have hybrids. Let's see. Um, man, I can't even find any. Uh, I was just about to say Tanny, but Tanny has one now. Um, I was just about to say Smile Dawn. Smile Dawn has one now. Uh, the Raptor Pack doesn't have hybrids. What else? The last Metherium. Scaphignathus. Oh, so basically a bunch of the Cenozoics minus Smilodon and the Raptor pack don't have hybrids. And I think like literally every other dino in the game has a hybrid. Okay, Myasaur doesn't. Myasaur doesn't. So Scaph, Maya, Raptor pack, and Cenozoics don't have hybrids. And everything else has a hybrid. Okay, I'm perfect. I, 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 I'm fine with that statement. I could still be wrong, but hey, I'll look at all look at all the DNA I have for Conk, man. <laughs> ridiculous. Anyways, let's start fusing uh, Diplovinator. All right, first one's a thirty. I'll take that. Okay, <laughs> Diplovinator actually has a really interesting move uh, move set. We'll we'll have to see what the stats are like uh, in a bit, though. Should 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 be fun. Um, any any time you get a Diplo hybrid, the design's gonna be. Hilarious, right? <laughs> because it's, because Diplocalus looks Diplocalus just looks funny, and, and I love it. It looks it looks totally adorable. Um, like oh my god, it has a teeth here. Oh, fifty. That's cool. Made up for the bunch of tens that we just got there. Oh, 40, Okay, we're rolling with uh some really high numbers here. All right, thirty. GG. Fifty, forty, thirty. Goddess Diplominator. I will take that. And. Oh my god! Yo! What? They made the to the super cute and adorable Diplo Diplo Callus Gen 2, like, gave it, like, really edgy, you know, red and black colorings, and it looks, and now it looks like a little, little devil or whatever. <laughs> Hey, I'll take red and black coloring. That's my that's my team colors, right? Red and black for the Raptors. Anyways, let's put this thing. Oh, let's check the. You know, let's just read out the moves up first before we put it in. Um, definite strike. That's a good strike. Instant distraction. Striking impact. Distracting rampage. Precise counter counter. Ah, oh, this move set is, this move set is hilarious. Three distracts and then a counter. This is an absolutely hilarious move set. <laughs> And then to pair it up with one of the most hilarious designs in the game, it's it's this is this is a perfect dino. It, it, this is an absolutely perfect dino. It's 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 peak perfection here right now. Anyways, <laughs> jokes aside, uh, let's put this thing in the the um the team and go in for a uh, for a friendly and you know see how it uh, actually um does and stuff. See its animations. It's, I'm just it's gonna be hilarious. <laughs> oh boy, and also stats, but yeah, no. stats or whatever. Okay, the challenge isn't really going through right now. I don't know what's going on. Let's try that one again. No, hopefully, you could draw it as well. Not take me like thirty tries to just to draw it. So that's what happened to the uh, con conquistadors. I don't even know what it's called. No, Carno. Carnotuckus? I don't know. It's gonna take me a while to get used to um new new dinos names and terms and all that. Anyways, Diplovenator. Let's go. Rex. Oh, Rex, come on. Get out of here. Oh my god. It does not have a lot of HP though, what I have to say. And not a lot of damage either. <laughs> well, you know, it 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 does have you know a one times counter, so 
not the biggest deal that it doesn't have too much <laughs> damage there. Um, you know what? I'm gonna go instant distract, let the counter do the work, and then save the distracting rampage for the next dino. Profit. Oh no! Look how much they nerfed crit! It did zero damage! <laughs> oh my god. <laughs> By the way, I'm joking guys, don't don't actually think they nerfed crit that it does zero damage now. It's because of the distract uh, distraction test stack, but they did nerf crit. It's what, uh, 0.25 now. <laughs> Anyways, let's keep this one going. Ineasuchus is going to do a lot of damage. Um, but so am I, so am I. But wait, is it enough to take us out? That's no armor, right? Oof, it's going to be close. How much does Ineasuchus do? Ooh, close one, close one. Very close. All right. There's the counter. Um, I'm gonna throw in a little uh, instant distraction here. Last ditch effort. Um, we're still gonna get stunned, or not? I guess we could dodge stun, but you know. Oh, we actually dodged the stun and didn't get killed. Well, <laughs> by the way, if you guys were wondering why it actually did damage. It's because it has Ferocious on. It, it's like it's it's like an additive thing. So um, uh, you have the damage buffs that you add up, and then like you have to uh, you have to subtract the uh, the the, uh, the 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 debuffs in that equation, and that's why it does it did some damage. All right, let's finish this thing off. Oof, and Dom. Oh, and Dom um, do really great against Trico just because Trico has a shield up. Ouch. Still a lot of damage. Still a lot of damage. Um, why are we slowed? Oh, yeah. I need to... Oh, yeah. I need to see D-Cell Strike now. Forgot about that. Okay. Gosh, just had to flex on us before we... Before we take it out, eh? Just had to flex on us. But, look now. Dodge! Indom dodged the attack, but still takes damage. Dodge is... <laughs> Dodge got destroyed this patch. Wow. Poor thing. So even if you dodge the attack, you still take like 33.33% of the uh, the of the damage. There. Alright. Let's try this one again. Oh, also. Free incubators. Um, free incubators are, uh, the, are, are decently important now since they do give uh, toys and stuff or interactions. Or interaction stuff, I guess. If you want to call it that instead. Alright. Let's try this one again. Hopefully, you could draw a dip. What was it called? Diplo. Diplo Diplovenator? 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 I don't know. I don't know. You guys tell me <laughs> what it's supposed to be called. Although, I don't think any of you guys actually know. Unless you guys, if you're a Ludia developer watching, then you probably wouldn't know. Anyways, I, did, I didn't draw it. Anyways, I'll. I'll uh, I'll just keep on restarting matches until we uh we do get it. All right, here we got Diplo Venator. Is that what it's called? Diplo Ven Yep, Diplo Venator again, and the uh, Carno Tarkus. Carno Tarkus. <sighs> it's named so hard. Um. Oh, it's Rex again. Rex is just gonna, like Diplo Venator just obliterates Chompers, uh, because you know takes away their damage, damage, and now especially with the crit uh, reduced, uh. It, yeah, like, Chomps have, like, nothing against a Diplominator, right? Which is great for Diplominator. Um, but, you know, it's it's, ex it's expected. You have, like, high damage, slow dinos, that, like, their only thing that they have going for them is damage. Then if that damage gets, like, cut down, well, it doesn't have anything else going for it, right? Um, it, they, they usually do have decent HP, though, but then again, Diplominator does actually have a decent amount of damage output per turn, even though it has, what, 1,000 base stat or something. Um, it actually does have decent damage output, considering that it also has a full counter, and that it has a Rampage. So it could potentially, at most, do like 3,000 uh, per turn without crits, right? So, you know, not bad for, for what it's trying to do. Oof. Um, yikes. Uh, I, I think I have one more turn. 
since like I don't have too much HP to begin with. Okay, never mind. I don't have another turn. <laughs> uh, actually, I do. Actually, no, they're just gonna spirit strike. Never mind. Um, oh well. Yeah. Oh well. Can't do much about that. They're just, they're just gonna spirit strike this one. Yep. There it goes. Oh. Well. Um, Devilator obviously it suffers greatly from Superiority Dinos, Cleansing Dinos, and Immune Dinos. So, as cool as Diplovator's kit looks, um, I don't really think it really fits this meta really well. And, you know, don't get me wrong, I love its kit. Its kit looks extremely fun, but, uh, yeah, I, I just don't think it's gonna work out too well in, in this meta, just because there's a, quite a few really strong Immune Dinos, or Earl, i still great uh despite the nerfs well it, you know what it's really hard to call earl dom a nerf like uh, of all the dinos that got dodge or or or, or that had dodge it, the hardest one to call a nerf is probably earl dom um press wrath of mime is a straight up buff uh i don't care what people say, like it's press wrath of mime got buff everyone else kind of got nerfed a bit uh here and there but earl dom it's hard to say because like with that boosted damage like Erlon doesn't need Cloak to, like, do stuff. There are Dinos that need, absolutely need Dodge to do some. Monomimus absolutely needs Dodge to perform at all with 127 speed and, like, you know, crispy crisp for HP. Like, it, it needed Dodge. But, uh, you know, Erlon doesn't really need that. So Erlon's still great. It's, you know, people are still going to be using it. Um, I'm pretty sure people are going to still be using it in the game for the most part. And... Uh, Magna, although it gets one shot by Drake of Sarah now, that's, people are still gonna, they're, they're still gonna use it. Um, I don't really see an argument for not using it at all. Anyways, um, we're gonna get kill here, unless we, yeah, we do have da enough damage to take it out. And it's precise, so even if they cloak, it doesn't really matter here. And they do cloak. And then we precise rampage them out with, uh, Car Carnotarchus. That's, that's such a weird name it gets. Feels weird when it rolls off the tongue. Anyways, which is why I, I like need a nickname for this guy like ASAP. I don't like when things don't roll off my tongue well. Um, Carnotarchus. Oh Jesus Christ! <laughs> not not knocking on the uh, whoever created this name, but you know it's just personal preference. Not a huge fan of the name. It probably means something significant, which I don't really care. <laughs> just I I need to I, I need to find a nickname soon. Um, let's see if if I could like do one on the spot. Uh, no, no, no. <laughs> yeah, no, can't do it. Anyways, uh, if you guys got any ideas for a, <laughs> I, and I know this is Diplovinator uh video, and you can do a Diplovinator nickname if you want, but uh, you know. Throw me some suggestions for Carnotarchus nickname down in the comments section down below. And um, I would greatly appreciate it if, if we find a really good one. And I'll, I'll probably use it. But anyways, that's going to be it for this one. Hope you guys enjoyed it. Um, subscribe to the channel for um, all the new 1.8 hybrids. I will be unlocking them all as I do. Fortunately, do have the resources for all of that. And um, they should be slowly putting throwing them on, on, on the channel. I, I, last time I like did them all in one day and I kind of think... That was probably a bad idea, because first of all, um, I didn't sleep at all, so I kind of need some sleep, and, uh, it, it, you know, people get fati uh, fatigued by it, so, uh, yeah, I'll, I'll, I'll put these on the videos, uh, or, or these, these videos on the channel, so do stay subscribed to get them, and also hit the notification bell if you do want to see them as soon as possible when they come out, and, um, yep, that's going to be it for this one, um, I'll see you guys in the next video, then.